Hello, this is Russ Walden with Father's Heart Ministry, and this is the Daily Prophetic Word. The Father says today, press into my kingdom. Press into being God inside-minded. When you feel overwhelmed by the world, it challenges a storm cloud obscuring your path. Open your mouth. Reach down into your heart and unleash the faith that moves mountains in your way. When I told the disciples, greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world, you were uppermost in my mind and my heart, for the authority that derives from the throne plays no favorites, is not bound by time or the happenstance of your situation. What you are facing, it may seem bigger than you, but never forget that I am in you, ruling, reigning, and militating on your behalf to break down the walls of captivity around you and cause you to walk out into a level of freedom and entitlement in Christ you've never fully experienced. Never stray in your thoughts from believing and acting upon the fact that the very essence of my presence dwells within you. It represents an immense power, far exceeding any earthly struggle you are up against. I said in my word, says the Father, that there are rivers of my spirit on the inside of you. That isn't a metaphor for a river. It is a river of power, refreshing, strength, and peace. Within you lies a wellspring of unwavering resilience and authority that dwarfs any obstacle you confront. This is an empty rhetoric. It's an unshakable fact. The spirit resident within you surpasses any sin that may tempt you, any sickness that may afflict you, any lack you may experience. It is far greater. My spirit on the inside of you is far greater than any doubt, any fear that this world can unleash upon you. Therefore, when you feel burdened, remember this, you're not walking this path alone. The greater one walks beside you. And more importantly, resides within you. Call upon me promptly and expectingly. Rely on my unwavering strength and face your challenges with renewed confidence. It is not a question of your own abilities, but of divine force by my hand, the unleashing of my kingdom welling up within you, working through you and flowing out from you through your faith filled words to destroy all the works of the enemy. You are more than a conqueror and more than a match for the unlimited resources of the enemy for the limited resources of the enemy. Go forth then with boldness and unwavering faith for the greater one again lives within you. With me as your guide, beloved, you cannot fail. I want to remind you that 2 Chronicles 20, 20 says, Believe the prophets, so shall you prosper. And that word prosper means come to breakthrough. And again, notice that that verse does not say believe the prophecies. It says believe the prophets. There's a big, big difference. God told a, a prophet by the name of William Branham, probably one of the greatest prophets of recent times. And the angel of the Lord appeared to him and said, if you can get the people to believe, nothing will stand before you, not even cancer. That is my responsibility as a prophet to give you something that you can wrap your faith around. I am here to be the prophet in your life. The greatest uh, opposite expression of faith is unbelief, and you never see as much faith or as much unbelief as when it comes to giving and donating. And I learned this from Kim Clement. I watched Kim Clement as the Holy Spirit, when he would minister, he would get to a point where the Spirit of God was present in a strong way, and he would say, give now, donate now, sow your seed now for the breakthrough you're believing God for. And there's something about that kind of faith. And I get it, not everybody's ever going to reach that place of believing. Well, 
their lack of faith excludes them. But I'm here to tell you God wants to include you. Go to www.fathersheartministry.net, click on the donation link, and let your faith soar. Mix this word with some faith by sowing into its fulfillment in your life. The kingdom of God doesn't come with observation. That means you have to do something. The faith that it takes to give into a prophetic word is equivalent to the faith involved in bringing that very word to pass in your situation. And it's important that you act now because your response time to God is a metric of God's timing in bringing that very breakthrough to pass in your situation. Again, go to www.fathersheartministry.net, click on the donation link. Or you could text to give by texting the word PROPHET to 44321. Cash app is dollar sign prophetic now or Zell is prophetic now at gmail.com. This is Prophet Russ Walden. I'm here to be the prophet in your life. Be reminded today that the sky isn't falling. You know this next part, the kingdom is coming. God bless you.